Good morning guys, since it's uh, 8 a.m. Sunday, I have some time. And since my ArchNex install tutorial was so popular, I thought I should quickly make a better one with uh, an encrypted hard drive. And um, also some people seem to be getting confused how you should do the network. System D network D is how you should do the network. So I'm gonna quickly go through that again. Hopefully it will be close to 10 minutes, but I'm, I'm feeling a little bit uh, tired this morning. So let's see how this one goes. First, I'm gonna prepare the USB stick. Da -da -da. I think it's usually SDA1. Yeah. Just just using a DD a DD command. This is the machine I'm gonna be installing it to. It's an X1 carbon three again. Okay, it's ready. So the idea is that when the machine boots you have to type a password to unlock it. And obviously the idea is if it ever gets stolen, no one can really use any of the data on there. Okay, I need to give it power. I've already given it I've already given it wired network. I then need to Okay, so I gotta go in and now I need to record all this juicy stuff using OBS. But now it would seem that my audio doesn't work. Ah, the joys, the joys. The joys of the, of the Linux U.S. subsystem. Start recording. Okay, let's choose a sand disk. Let's choose Arch. Let's go. Oh, this does not look good. Oh, it, it's fine. All right. Okay, I actually probably gonna to refer to my video times. Oh, uh, Arsenix uh, encrypted disk. Okay, this is how I work. I I, I Google. I Google. Okay, so you need. Oh, fuck, how do you do this again? Terminus font. I don't know why I'm bringing so much other stuff in. I'm recording, right? Yep. Then I go. So let me just go from memory here. It's okay. It's I just blocked the C. Yeah, it's SD SDA one G disk for the GPT. Okay. Uh oh. Invalid GPT. Okay. Interesting. Um. Okay. First sector. Uh, plus five, twelve megabytes. This is this is just for the boot partition. The boot can be clear. 
you know, if the Linux hacker gets that one, it's not really the end of the world. Uh, whatever. Okay, now this is this is the important part. This is where you do the crypt setup. Crypt uh, setup. Minus Y, minus V. I'm just looking on the web thing. Looks format dev. This looks like the right one. Yay. Yes. Okay, that didn't work. Why didn't it work? What is it? Looks format. Uppercase. Sorry, read the freaking instructions. Pass for it. I'm going to just set it to something simple. YouTube. YouTube. What next? Okay, now I need to open it. YouTube. Okay, now I need to make a fs four on that thing. So now it's like a on Dev Mapper. I think. This is an LVM style way of doing things. Can't really remember. Okay, dev mapper. So now it's it's like unencrypted right now. When it's on dev mapper. Okay, then I'm then I need to mount. Uh, oh yeah, then I need to make a boot here. Mount dev. I'm gonna mount the clear. Um, oh shit. I need to mount the the fat partition. Is it V fat thirty two? Dev SD one. Oh man, what's the Um. Okay. Now pack strap it. Okay, so now the tricky thing is making sure I can you can boot it. I was trying to remember how I do it. Yep, yep, yep. Crypt device. Yep, 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 yep. Pretty much the same, except the crypt you de device thing. The device UUID, and you should drop encrypt in there too. Yeah, this is definitely the simplest way to keep everything encrypted. Okay, um, okay, arch strap, mount. Okay, what do you have to do here? Boot CTL install, I guess. And then, uh, 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 I can't remember. It's not LS block, it's a uh, block ID. Isn't it make in it? Oh yeah, there is, there is. So you, <clears throat> yeah, yeah. 
Just installing Vim. Just installing Vim. Sorry, I keep on hitting caps lock because uh, I'm used to using this. The caps lock is escape nowadays. Um, okay. Yeah. Let's set up the boot. Configuration. Still as of June 2017, not auto-generated. There, there is a systemd script to do it, but uh, ArchNX, I believe, hasn't integrated it for whatever reason. Arch.conf. Okay, title, Arch Linux. Encrypted, baby. Linux VM. Linux, uh, I always get this wrong. And one typo, and you get the most horrible boot message. Sorry. Okay, this is where it gets a bit hectic. Uh, is it LS block? No, it's block ID. Block. Script device equals. Oh, man. Ah! The perils of having <laughs> caps lock on. Um, it's SDA two. Yeah, I think it's this is the one. Just using visual selection, yank. Um, paste, is that right? One one five D. Oh, it needs to be crypt root. Root equals dev mapper. Yeah. yeah, you don't need to worry about the um, oh. Stop recording. So you don't, sorry, I lost you there for a moment. I think my camera only can record it like 30 minutes at a time. Just doing the crypt root bit. I think that's cool. Um, I think I might have to do a make in it. What's it called? Make in it. I can never remember the command. Let's have a look here. Make in it. Okay, I think that's, yeah, you see it's configuring the encrypt thing there. I think that should be enough. That's, that's hopefully, that's, that's hopefully, hopefully that's enough. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Ooh, the pass phase. YouTube. Okay, please give the video a like and I hope you enjoyed um, it so far. And if you know better than I do, 
it would be nice. It would be nice if this was a little bit more automated, but in the, in a way, I like the bare bones of Archinex and just building yourself up from 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 uh, first principles for from from the very the base. Got to keep it raw here, guys, so you actually understand your system. Okay, guys. Bye.